Today marks one year since the Dobbs decision was handed down by the Supreme Court, a ruling which upended 50 years of settled law on who has a freedom to make decisions about when someone starts or expands their family. And since that time, we've seen more than 20 states pass laws limiting or eliminating the right to one's own body for more than 148 million Americans. For 50 years, Roe v. Wade left that decision in the hands of families. But today, Republican politicians, well, they've decided that they know what's best. They've decided that they should get to make that decision, not you. New Jersey has taken important and necessary steps to protect the right to choose. New Jersey has said to the nation that in New Jersey, people make their own decisions about what is right for them and their families. And it's time we use New Jersey as an example of what it looks like when we give the American people the freedom of choice. Around the country, people have made clear that they want that choice. In election after election, from Kansas to California, Montana to Michigan, the people have pushed back against this overreach and voted to defend these rights. People deserve the right to choose, and it's past time that we reflect that in our actions. I've signed into eight bills to defend the rights of people to make their own reproductive choices and to protect them from retaliation by protecting their medical privacy. I welcome your advocacy and your support in pushing the envelope so that we can ensure that women have agency over their bodies and that individuals in this country can make a decision with regard to reproductive choices. Thank you and God bless you.